at the 2014 MTV Video Music Awards. We can't wait to chat with all the celebs that stop by the red carpet. So have you guys been to the VMAs before? Never, Never. been. Never. Never. It's all at once. Yeah. No, it's crazy. What are you guys excited to see here tonight? Uh, uh, you know, we're excited to see uh, Beyonce. My, my girl B. Yeah. yeah you, girl? My girl yeah. B. She's our girl. Yeah. She's, yeah, she's where it's at. If, if you could use like one word to describe the energy here, what would you use? Excited. Yeah. Who are you hoping to see inside? Everyone. Um, Is there anyone you want to get like a selfie with? Well, I would die to get a selfie with Adam Levine because I love him and I've been a fan since like before The Voice even happened and I've always been obsessed with him. And what can we expect um, on Awkward coming up? Um, well, the second half of the season starts airing in Awkward, er, October. Awkward. Uh, awkward. <laughs> um, and you can see a lot, you know, you get to see what happens with Eva. You know, is she pregnant? Is she not? What do you think? I can't say. <laughs> No, how do you like amp it up for an event like the VMAs? Uh, I don't know. Call my stylist. Call everybody else. Say so. Help me, help me. Make me glam. Yeah, make me glam. Have fun. Who are you excited to spot inside the VMAs? Taylor Swift, Ariana Grande. I saw her a little bit ago. You did? Yeah. Excited to see Beyonce. So, what can we expect from Echo Smith for the rest of the year? Lots of touring. We're touring with American Authors and then with Neon Trees and then we're doing a headlining tour and lots of random international and local things. So, Where are you most excited to go internationally? We're going to the Philippines on Tuesday. So I'm super excited. We've never been outside of North America. So, yeah. Did you know you can um, take a mermaid class in the Philippines where you like wear a fin? You should do that. What do you do? Do you just swim like a mermaid? They like teach you how to be a mermaid. Oh Where? man, I can't I'm wait. I knew I needed to bring my bathing suit. That's yes! It. It's a sign. I, I will be a mermaid pants. next time you see me. <laughs> Hi, how's it going? Hello. Hi. I was I'm crashing this party too. I was Woo! It's a faking party. <laughs> Ow! So are you guys excited to see perform tonight? Beyonce. Beyonce. It's unanimous. And you guys too? Beyonce? Yeah, for sure. And Sam Smith. And, and Ariana Grande, uh, Nicki Minaj, and Jessie J doing Bay Bang. No, I, everybody. She's so excited about everybody. We, we are all going to be standing and dancing. Actually, I'm not going to speak for everyone else. I will be standing and dancing the whole as time. Much as I will be joining allowed. you for sure. Yeah. To yes. dance. Can you give me a little preview of your dance moves? <laughs> okay, guys, I'm with Jeremy Scott. How's it going? Good. How are you? I'm good. What do you think of all the fashion here tonight? It's so exciting. That's what I love about the VMAs. It's like the one place where you just got to let your freak flag fly. <laughs> and that's why it's so much fun. It's like just turn up the volume and just have fun. And where these performers can be really like the purest essence of themselves. And yeah. who did you dress here tonight? Uh, Ariana Grande. You'll see her coming down the red carpet. Um, yeah. Have you guys worked together before? She's worn things, but this is the first time I've dressed her for an uh, official you know, capacity in that way. So fun. Yeah. And tell me about your look tonight, because you look fabulous. Oh, thank you. I'm wearing a, a yellow tuxedo from my first Moschino men's collection with a smiley face on the I back. I love it. Bringing the smiley faces out. Hey, you know, I felt like I love fancy clothes, but I thought, how could I do something new? So I thought, take it yellow, put the smiley on the back, you know, get a little something when you're coming and going. So how excited are you to be here tonight? Beyond excited. It's my first VMAs and I'm part of the MTV family now, so it's kind of a nice little initiation today. Yeah. Yeah. So you're on a show called Happy Land, right? Yes. Tell me about it. It follows the story of all of these kids who work at a theme park named Happy Land. And as the show goes on, you find out that it is very ironically named because nothing happy ever happens in Happy Land. You go behind uh -oh. the scenes and it's, it's chaos. There's dirty little secrets that are coming out about all the people that work there. And uh, the, we've, we've moved past the love triangle. We have a love octagon. It's, uh -oh. it's crazy. Are you involved in this? Oh, yes. My, my character, Harper, is extremely boy crazy, and it gets her into a lot of trouble, but it was sure fun to shoot. How are you feeling getting ready for your album to come out? It's amazing. I, I'm just, you know, I'm gearing up for a really, really fun year, and Secrets is doing really well, and um, and uh, I don't know. I'm excited for people to hear it. I, I'm just so proud of it. It's, it's my dream album, and so I'm so excited to share it with the world. And now you performed at the VMAs last year. You did, like, a remote performance, yeah, right? Yeah. Do you have any, like, advice for performers, like, any tips you would tell them? I just, I just try to uh, just think that I'm just practicing. It's just, I just, if I, if I really psych myself out, then I'm going to screw up. So Take it too like, seriously. So I was like dancing around backstage right before the curtain went up. And I think, I think uh, Macklemore and Ryan both kind of looked at me like, what are you on? And I'm like, no, I'm just excited. Um, now tell me about your look. How did you guys put this together for the VMA? I was like, I'm going to wear all black. 
Yeah. And be really got some gray. Yeah, I do have some. Some some gray can show through the black. Yeah. Um, well, I didn't have any clothes because I, I don't live in LA. So I came down here, and then the day before, I was like, I don't have anything for the VMAs. So I, I used the wisdom of my girlfriend and my friend Angie. And I was like, please, please help, help me. I don't know, so, I don't know how to dress. So you're saying you didn't dress yourself at all? Not really, no. So they could have made you wear a clown outfit and you'd have been like, I guess this it, is what you're supposed to wear. If that's what they would have suggested, I probably would have. <laughs> Are you guys shooting anything here tonight? No, no. actually, no. They, we, we tried our best. We're going to try our best to get on we'll, we'll stage. Streak. We'll streak across the stage. Don't tell them, though. Oh. I won't tell anybody. Your secret is safe with Young Hollywood. Did, did the girls dress you in a way that's easily yeah, all, rip off a bowl? It all just tears. Snap off? That was my one stipulation. It has to be able to just tear Snap right off. off. Yeah. Good. So I'm sure that narrowed down your options. Yeah. It did, yeah. I just had to go to um, Fredericks of Hollywood, yeah. <laughs> oh, beautiful. Beautiful.